All right, welcome back. We are going to create a YouTube banner according to the YouTube measurements. And just as a tip there, the same measurements you use for your YouTube banner or the same banner you will create for YouTube, you can use that entire banner for your Facebook page. And what I mean by entire banner, I mean the whole entire measurement size. And you're going to see here, I'm going to show some um, what I mean, I'm going to get into detail. If I am speaking a little bit fast, just go ahead and slow the speed on playback. Click on the three dots to the top right there and click playback and slow down. If I am speaking fast, um, I have a habit of doing that and not really thinking through now that I've said it, I might just, you know, remember to talk slower. Um, all right, so in your YouTube studio, you're going to go to customization. When you go to customization, you are going to click on branding. When you click on branding, you are going to go to your banner image. It's going to display the size that YouTube wants your banner image to be in. We're going to utilize websites for free to create a free banner. Now, here's the thing. YouTube asks for 2048 by 1152. Okay. This is a size they ask for their television layout. And I'm going to show you it's an ugly banner back here. I've been playing with stuff. Um, but I'm going to show you the true to measurement size. Let's go with let's go with this example. Well, let's go with this example. All right. This is a banner I created already for myself, for my other YouTube channel. And so you will see I had to kind of squish things in the middle because I like my banner to show nice on the mobile devices. Now, if you wanted to look at this banner on a desktop, this is how it will look. It still looks nice because of the colors in the background. They still kind of, it's a light green. They still kind of go with the flow. And on mobile devices, this is the little window even though this entire page is the measurements they have called for. And I'm going to show you what I mean by it's viewable on TV. So when you look at it on your television, you will see the full measurements that YouTube has called for. So when I typically make my YouTube banners, I make them within the measurements to be viewable on all devices friendly, but mainly on your cell phone device or your tablet. You'll be able to still see some of this. All right, so now I'm going to cancel out of that. So now let's go with that in mind. Let's go create a YouTube banner. I'm going to introduce to you if you have not already heard of the website called Canva. It is a free website right here. I am for the free free. Okay, if you want to try the Canva Pro, that's probably a membership or something, a subscription or something like that. But that is Canva. I am signed up for their free um free version. I find satisfaction in all their free version templates included. Um, and then so Canva does a really good job giving us templates that are pre filled with the things that we need. And if that is not satisfactory to you, you can look for stock free images. One of the websites I go to is Pexels, P E X E L S dot com. And you could just type in whatever it is that you're looking for up here. And then you can download. And uh, usually they ask for a donation. I think it's just a kind gesture to the people that take the pictures, but you could still continue to download. And I use these uh, stock free images for my banners. And so if you wanted to use the stock free images, stock free, meaning you can use the images without paying because usually you go pay for the licensing and so forth. You might want to read onto the licensing if you want to make a profit with the images here, just because they're free images does not mean that you could go create book covers and so forth and or just read the licensing if you're going to do other than banners. All right. I'm not turning a profit off of pictures on banners. Now let's go. We are going into Canva. YouTube has asked us to have a measurement of 2048 by 1152 pixels. So you open up your Canva 
You do your 2048 by 1152 pixels. Make sure it says pixels right there so that we can have a template for our banner slash you could slap this banner on your Facebook. Facebook, it'll be the whole entire thing that will fit on your Facebook as a banner. All right. So now, and when I mean entire thing, that means Facebook is not asking, is not showing you a device. Um, what else was, was YouTube? YouTube showed us three things, your cell phone, tablets, or and something else, and then the desktop. Uh, Facebook, this whole entire measurement will be your banner. All right, so now we're here. We're inside of Canva. We have our measurement, okay? What is your channel? What's your niche? What are you looking for? These are all for the free free. Now, of course, with exceptions with the ones with the crown, those will be paid. And if you want to do their pay subscription, you have access to a whole lot more tools and templates on Canva. As long as I've been using Canva, I have not yet needed the need to create because I get everything I need here. And if I'm not getting anything I need, I do go get my own pictures and so forth and customize according to what it is that I'm looking for. So mine is going to be a unique channel. It has been a food recipe mukbangish channel, but now it's going to morph. And so, but let me look and see what they got under food. Wow. They got amazing, amazing templates under food. But remember, class. Even though I click on fresh and tasty, this entire fresh and tasty won't show up like so on a mobile device, but rather a television. So now I need a banner that I could almost put some writing in the middle like that so that it can really for me personally, so that it can show across all three. Um, these are beautiful banners. All right. So here is a food review banner right here at the bottom left. Okay, click on that. And let's just replace current page so I could show you the customization. This is this is right up my alley. I like this. But now I know that all of this is not going to show up. All of this. So I have to make decisions. I'm going to scooch this down here. I know if I write what I need right here, this will show up. And so now I'm going to write about my channel right here. All right, all right, all right. Okay. Got it. And if you need to change the font, you got your fonts right here. If you need to change the size, you got sizes. If you need to change the color, you have color. You play around with Canva until you are satisfied, my dear people. All right. So I think I'm satisfied with this. Bada bing, bada boom. Let's just, you know, increase this. Make sure my writing doesn't get lost in the sauce. Okay. And so... I don't really need to put anything on there. Let me think. Let me think. Let me think. Well, that's fine. All right. And maybe I may just let me first write in in here. All right. Okay. Yeah. Let me see with this color. I just, I'm in the mood. I mean, I'm used to just highlighting. And honestly, when you just highlight that text box, you should be good to go. I'm going to go look for a color. Canva recommends according to your template. Let's try the pink. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Because I need to scoot it up here. I'm not too concerned if this does show up on my YouTube devices. It's really... Not a big deal for this part here. So let's do that. And so since I'm not too concerned if it shows up on the YouTube, scooch it up here just to, and then you see when I scooch and so forth, the little lines, you know, keep everything. It's kind of faded and I should probably, I don't want to fill it in. Let's pick another color. You play with it until you're satisfied. Yes, honey. Yes. Um. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Blue. And then, you know, I know like there's so much that goes into this. Like what? Oopsies. 
color captures people's attention and so forth. You could do your Google research on that for colors to use and what's attention grabbing colors. And I mean, you could have a whole, I do like the current color though. I'm really just kind of basic. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. I think we might have to go back. We might have to just go back. I do like the, I like what we got going on here. Um, not too concerned about that because that's definitely not going to show on the old devices, but that's no problem. All right, so let's let us take this one off. Just highlight in here like that and click delete. Bang, bang. So now if you have YouTube, Instagram, little logos that you want to put on here, you can. Let me see. I think Canva had that at one point in time. Um, I don't recall, but I know I got my own. So, um, do, 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 let's see, let's see, subscribe, subscribe. Let's see, let's see about like and subscribe. Let's see. Okay, there you go. So you could do all this. You can put your doohickeys in here. I like this. It's kind of cute. I know it's like Facebook, right? Um, so yeah, let's for tutorial. Oh, Jesus. Okay. All right. You were obnoxious when you came in, sir. Let's just put it over here. What else they got? All right. Let's see. Let's take a look. Let's take a look. We got subscribe. What else do we do? What else do we do on YouTube? What else do we do? We subscribe. Like, oh, this is if you got, you know, pro, but that subscribe button is good. Um, let's see. Notification bell. Let's see if they got a notification bell. Come on, guys. Have fun with Canva. Okay, notification bell. Hmm. Look at that. Bring. Look at this one. Okay, do we need that? No, I don't like to be too dramatic. All right, so you got all this good stuff right here. I think I'm done. That's it. That's how simple I am. Nothing to it but to do it, baby. All right, so now I guess I'll save my file under the title, right? And once again, this is all free for the free free. Okay. And so now I just go to click share and I go click download because I'm going to download it to a file that I have on my computer and I'm going to see you guys. And so once I click download, I don't do anything with anything behind in the background in case I need to come back and tweak some stuff and move some stuff. But I'm going to see you all at the YouTube page. Oh, somebody forgot to click download. Not so fast. All right, so we're downloading. Okay, now it's down here. I'm going to put it in my folder. I will see you at the YouTube station, YouTube channel. All righty, welcome back to the YouTube channel. So now we are going to change. Let's see. We're going to go fetch our doohickey. All right, so now we got it. Okay, here's how it looks. Like I told you all, all of this is not, this is viewable on all devices. I What I'm particular about is the writing. Okay, you want it right there in the middle. In, in case I needed to go back and tweak it, I left my design up. But now if you view me on a desktop, you will kind of see a little bit more. Sure, can I squish stuff up and down? Sure, but obviously... These measurements are true to the television. So there you go. You'll be able to see all of that. So I think that's nice for me. Nothing too much, nothing too little. So I'm going to click done. YouTube has got their banner. We have updated my banner. And so once you click done, you got one more last step to do. You must publish. Okay. You click the publish button. All right. We click the publish button. And then... We are going to go see what we have done, class. And let us go to the channel. Okay. Alrighty. So now we are at the channel. Of course, I'm going to change the name. Calm down. Oh, you calm down too. Hey, 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 right, hey. Welcome so here to we are, family. La Familia, we have Sonography Talk Plus Recipes because that's what I'm about to morph this baby into. 
click the comment section below. Let me know if you um, are doing your banner on um, Canva or if you have done it, how it's worked out for you. And remember, guys, this entire banner can be if I had a Facebook page with the same um what do you call this niche or whatever channel you were doing, then you could slap the whole entire banner onto um, the Facebooks there. Mm -hmm. The Facebooks with an S. All right, family, I love you that much. Uh, be sure to subscribe, click on the notification bell, share the video. Let me know what you think in the comment section.